And the height, look, six foot three for Rafael Lovato Jr., six one for Mike Rhodes. And now, inside the Bellator cage, we go to three five pivot rounds in the middleweight division. Introducing the blue corner at six foot one, weighing in 185.2 pounds. His professional record: ten wins, four defeats from Waterloo, Iowa. My big hero. And across the cage, out of the red corner, at six foot three, weighing in 185.6 pounds. As a professional, he stands undefeated at five and zero from Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, Rafael Lovato Jr. In charge of the action, referee Big John McCarthy. Big John McCarthy is the referee for this middleweight matchup. Jimmy Lovato Jr., BJJ ace, but then this happened. Now you see the head kick, that's what started off. Rubber legs for his opponent, and look at this flurry of punches. That was all she wrote, 13 seconds. Maybe see some jujitsu tonight, we'll see. Are you ready? The Saul Hibero protege finishing all five of his opponents. Since making the transition to MMA in 2014 and fresh off that 13 second stoppage due to strikes of Charles Hackman. Meanwhile, Mike Rhodes has won four in a row coming into this, his Bellator MMA debut. Lovato Jr. in the red gloves, Rhodes in the blue gloves. Fight clock brought to you by Miller Lite, the original light beer. Cheers, it's Miller time. What Lovato gets to do is throw head kicks, throw stuff where he doesn't worry about getting taken down because there's a lot of confidence in his jujitsu and his ability to submit you off your back. Rhodes, a three-fight vet of the Ultimate Fighting Championship. As a wave of momentum coming into this contest against Lovato Jr., the Brazilian jiu-jitsu ace who, well, showed that he's more than just a one-trick pony, Jimmy. Rhodes so far not fighting scared. I like his confidence so far, waiting for those counter-punching opportunities. Rhodes grew up in Waterloo, Iowa, had a troubled past, got into a lot of fights, had anger management issues, was an athlete in high school in both basketball and football, continued his basketball career in college. And that's where he began to make the transition to mixed martial arts. He lost over 100 pounds and look at this, deep half guard. Trying to sit up beautiful sweep, ending up on top. Job of Rhodes getting to the fence, but this still is not where he wants to be. A beautiful stuff by Lovato Jr. And two of Rhodes' four losses have come via submission. Lovato searching for his fourth submission win, and this is sixth pro fight. He's got the rear naked choke. Done. He's not getting out of this. And that's it. Rafael Lovato Jr., a perfect 6 and 0 oh with his fourth victory via tap out. And no surprise here, as soon as he got the back, as soon as he got dominant position, start your stopwatch, because not many guys in the world could have gotten out of that. A dominant striking victory in his last outing, and now a dominant submission victory here to improve to 6-0, and oh, Rafael Lovato Jr. And it's time for the Blackheart Premium Spiced Rum Replay, the Bold 93 proof rum that's edgy to the core. Look at the timing on this takedown. He tried enough on the feet. He says, let me go to what I'm good at. Goes to that deep half guard and look at him sit up right into this sweep. Cross side, beautiful job. Wonder if they get it. This move that I love the way he took him down, but we don't see it. Both hooks in. At this point, Rhodes is trying to undo the hook because he knows he's done with that arm underneath the throat. He can't fight the choke anymore. He tries to fight the feet, but it was all over here. As soon as that arm was underneath the neck, Rafael Lovato Jr. was never going to let that go. No choice but to tap. Gutty performance by Rose, but the technique of Lovato Jr., once again, too much. All right, here's Michael C. Williams to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, inside the Bellator cage, the tap comes by way of a rear naked choke. Official time, one minute, 59 seconds into round number one. The winner by submission, still undefeated, Rafael Lovato Jr. A 
black belt under Carlos Machado, the oldest of the Machado family, Rafael Lovato Jr. is, is down with RNC as he improves to six and O oh here on the Bellator 181.